What is up, Stud Muffins? Welcome to Burgers and Tech. I'm Cheeseburgers Man, and for your tech bits for today, I have for you Apple iPhone 13 satellite connectivity will reportedly be just for emergencies. Okay, so Apple's upcoming iPhone 13 could be able to use satellite signals to send text messages in areas without cellular coverage. But at first, those messages will reportedly be limited to emergencies only. So what that means is you can be basically anywhere in the world, satellites are anywhere, they cover the entire planet. If you're stranded, in the middle of the Sahara or on a remote island and you have an iPhone 13 and there's a satellite hovering above you, you will be able to send a text message. According to this, the iPhone 13 could have a Qualcomm X60 baseband chip, chip allowing it to not only use 4G and 5G, but satellite signals. Now that sounds great in theory. This is a two-sided coin. Yes, it's great for emergencies if you're stuck in the middle of nowhere, in the desert, or stranded on a desert island. The other part is, which is not good, it doesn't matter if you have signal or not, they will be able to track you. And with the whole privacy thing going around right now, that means even if you're not around a cell phone tower, they will be able to track you via satellite. So yes, it works good because for people that are in emergency situation, they will be able to get help where they need it. It goes on to say, Bloomberg notes, it will primarily be a texting via satellite tool. You will be able to send SOS messages to emergency services or an emergency contact via message app and the text will be limited to a short length. So that's all fine and well, but do you want Apple and whoever can lo uh, link into your cell phone to know exactly where you're at at all times and that is your tech bit for today it's a one to make you think about big brother is always looking at you and for your burger bit what i have for you is this abomination <laughs> this comes from cnet as well i accidentally inhaled flaming hot mountain dew up my nose and i feel so alive i'm not a big fan of flaming hot line of chip so the flaming hot cheetos uh the different different the different types of uh, flaming hot that they have and this looks even more gross than those chips now this came out recently i don't think i'm gonna try it it looks very disgusting yeah it just looks so gross i don't know maybe you want to try it tell me what you think do you want to try it all right thanks for tuning in today let me know what your thoughts are do you think the emergency sos text messages is a good thing or is it a bad thing let me know in the comments below if you like this video hit that like button if you really like it hit that subscribe button thanks a lot and have a great day